everybody. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Tinkering Around. In this channel, I hope to show some of the random odds and ends and cool things I come across on a daily basis that I tend to collect and sometimes resell. Um, one of the things I really like that I find and usually pick up a lot is clocks. And I like different clocks of all types from cuckoos to weird digital clocks to things like this here that I'm going to show you today. I decided to do this video on this clock because from the research I did there's really not much information online regarding these clocks and it's just really neat and it's really uh, bizarre I guess. Anyone that's familiar with this brand uh, can you imagine they make a lot of really cool stuff. Another clock they make that's neat is the Time Machine, which I've had multiple of, and they're always fun to play with. They work with a ball bearing system that drops down to show the time. I'll put a picture of it right here. But this clock's a little different. It's really neat. It's called the Rat Race Action Clock. So I'll just go ahead and get into it and show you what it is. Um, it's, it's pretty neat. It's pretty bizarre. And like the time machine clock, it's pretty loud and pretty annoying, meaning it's definitely not a clock I would have running all the time in my household. Basically what's going on with this clock is, uh, hence the name, it's a rat race clock. You have this mouse wheel here and you got this little furry rat inside of it, which is pretty cool. You can see on the back here. It's all gear driven. All the gears actually turn in everything. Here's your uh, time set. And this clock runs off of four D batteries for the um, mechanism that moves the mouse wheel. And then also two A batteries, I assume for probably running the clock mechanism itself. So basically how this works is the mouse that you see in there, let me see if I can use this tripod right in the zoom. You can see on the bottom of the mouse there, the little white part there. And that's actually riding in that track you can see in the center of the wheel. And this mouse, he has a wire that goes to him from the back side. And basically what goes on is that mouse um, every 60 seconds he runs and his running turns the mouse wheel and changes the time and it's really neat how it works he even has the two little side tabs there you can see that when he runs it gives him that uh, twisty running motion so I'll just go ahead and show it to you now in action he likes to turn on the minute I press the button so here we go So, it's pretty neat. Um, like I said, he's got the wire in the back side of him. And he's got a little electric motor in the mouse himself. And you can actually pick him up and everything. And I mean, it's hard. And I try not to because that wire is pretty fragile looking. But uh, you can pick him up and move him around in the wheel. And I just set him back down into the track there. And uh, when he gets his signal from the computer he runs turns the wheel you can see the minute hand will move with his running and uh, he runs until he gets that exact next minute move it's it's pretty interesting pretty funny and enjoyable but like i said it's also loud and annoying to go off every 60 seconds should be going off pretty soon here again There he goes. So that is the Can You Imagine? Uh, I think the bigger brand name is HPI, maybe? I'll check it here in a second. So I'm still learning to use this gimbal here, so there we go. So yeah. There you go. Can you imagine a clock that reminds us to slow down and relax? The Rat Race Action Clock. Very neat. Uh, 
made in China, of course. Can you imagine? Let's see if there's a year on the box here. I don't see one. But yeah, we've got the clock here. It's probably going to go off again. Original paperwork. It tells you about carefully loading the battery and everything. He's neat. I like him a lot. I wish I could find a year on it because I'm really curious when he was produced. There's almost always a year on the box and this is one of the rare times that I don't think there is. Nope. So, thanks for watching this interesting little video um, about the rat race mouse clock there and I hope you enjoy it as much as I do these funny little weird things and I hope you like this new YouTube channel where I'll randomly be uploading things that I like and enjoy and think are neat uh, tinkering around and of course every once in a while when I come across broken stuff I'll be repairing it and I'll try to document those repairs and showing different things so thanks guys see ya